probe launched. Launching probe. launched. Launching probe. something.
broke away. away. found something.
Thank you. 
would like to respond to complaints about our upcoming film, Blast of the Jellyfish Stings. The Hanar Anti-Defamation Association claims that our portrayal... You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. So far as no, you don't understand! I lost it somewhere in the future. How can you short sell and hate that after the these human colonies? The growing importance of these respects. Holy crap, Shepard! I thought you were dead. I gotta get back to work. Another difficult development for human expansion as the colony on Horizon has been attacked. The Council has pledged to investigate the matter thoroughly. For as example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12 page contract. How about you? Going to try and make it as a commando? Blue Rose of Ilium. Hi. Please try to ignore my non-boyfriend's non-poetry. Can I help you? I'll talk to you later. It's just... we're looking for weapons. Shouldn't you be taking this seriously? You're Shepard? I don't know if you remember me. I was a colonist at Zeus Hope on Pharos. You saved us from that enormous Geth attack, and from the Thorian creature's control. Too many people died in the fighting for us to save the colony. It's still better than being a slave to the Thorian, though. I'm sorry. I've got other things to deal with. Oh. Okay. Uh, but just don't sign anything. We're getting screwed over on a contract we signed with Baria Frontiers for some medical studies. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or... Did she kill somebody already? I have no idea. Just tell me where she is. If you insist, but fair warning, watch yourself around Samara. Justicars have a nasty habit of shooting people. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. 
I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. to be a just a car when I was young. Every sorry does, I guess. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need to find Samara and get back to my mission, with or without your help. Sounds important. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. We've got that covered. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. Just a car code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Samara would kill a cop? That doesn't sound very just. She would die defending an honest cop, but she'd fight an army of dirty cops to the death. I admire her dedication, but her presence is still a big problem. I need her gone before I have to carry out my orders. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. I have to go. Good luck. We'd better find Samara before the detective goes after her. told us to let you through. Watch yourself. There's Merc activity back here. We're waiting on backup. You can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar. <laughs> what was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! 
Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. <laughs> My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? I'm Commander Shepard, and I need your help with a critical mission, Samara. You honor me, but I am in the middle of an investigation. I need you to help me take down the Collectors. The Collectors are a worthy foe. I would relish testing myself against them. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. I'll get the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well... I've got to get back to my station, and I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. interested in weapons, I have a fine selection. Unfortunately, I am not open for business right now. Why are the mercs after you? I know nothing about any mercenaries, Earth Clan. I'm merely an innocent merchant. Oh dear. Please put that away. I'll be cooperative, I swear. Tell me everything. I smuggle the chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse. So they are perturbed and want to kill me. I need to get into the Merc base. You're gonna help me. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. Spotted.
didn't fire my weapon once. I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. You're in an enemy uniform, and I'm gonna kill you. I'm not one of them. I'm new. I thought being Elnora the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. You chose your side, Elnora, and you lost. Screw that, bitch! I'll take it! Subdue and suppress. been spotted.
it's official. Little baby Elnora is finally a full-fledged Eclipse Merc. I earned my uniform last night when I killed that ridiculous bolus. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friend is gonna be so jealous. Detective Anaya would be interested in this. Shipping manifest it shows that Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of Red Sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves that the Volus is a criminal. Sell it to the Volus. He'll pay. We're running into a lot of Red Sand addicts these days. Idiots. Who would do that to themselves? You take drugs all the time. If I don't, I wake up screaming with furniture slamming into the wall. We gotta keep moving. I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. I don't know what drugs you're on, but stay back and I won't shoot you. You will regret your scandalous words. I am a great wind that will sweep all before me like a... A great wind. A great biotic wind. Yes. The Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. That I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Are you part of Pitney Force trade group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. He hasn't reported your disappearance. Probably so his departure won't get delayed. When the chips are down, even your friends will screw you for an extra cred. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first... 
the leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasea about like a rag doll. Shepard, having this incapacitated Volus running around our battlefield could compromise us. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. Charge. An ill wind blows upon Wasea, captain of the Eclipse Sisters. After me! That was mean, but damn funny. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off-world. First a Justicar shows up, now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass! <laughs> Must be the ship Samara was looking for. Should we head back to the police station and give her the name, or look around first? Let's give her the name and keep moving. Thank you for removing the Eclipse threat, Earth Clan. It will take them months to rebuild their organization. Also, merely out of curiosity, when you were poking about, did you perhaps run across a shipping manifest that belongs to me? We both know this manifest will get you sent away for a long time. Absolutely, Earth Clan. For the manifest, I'll give you all the creds I made selling the Minigen. You never know when something like this might come in handy. If it might change your mind, Earthclan, returning that manifest would be very profitable for you. If you give it to the detective, her reward will be a pat on the back. Did you change your mind? I'll pay you well for that manifest. Here's the manifest. Next time you do something illegal, don't write it down. An excellent point, Earth Clan. You're clearly a better criminal than I. If you have something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. 
And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. You're sworn to follow a code that dictates your decisions, but I'm running a military operation. You wonder if I will refuse to follow orders because of my code? I can't allow that to happen. By agreeing to follow you, I am compelled to swear the most difficult of Justicar oaths, the third oath of subsumation. After I do, your orders will override the code. You should know, however, that I'll still give you my opinion if the situation warrants. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. Now you have to do whatever I tell you. I am you. sworn to you. Do not make more of it than that. Shall we return to your ship? Let's go. Welcome to the Normandy, Samara. We've studied your profile extensively. With your skills, I think you'll be an excellent addition to our team. Thank you. From an organization such as yours, that is high praise indeed. With what we're planning, we need all the experienced people we can get. We still don't know what we're going to find when we hit the Collectors. I will be prepared for whatever we encounter. Where shall we put you? A room that looks out on the great empty void would be most comforting. Put her in the observation room on deck three. Thank you. I must meditate on the day's events.